Ingenuity has survived the brutally cold Martian winter and received a software update. Its latest flight has begun to test the new capabilities with a flight over hazardous terrain that's also starkly beautiful. On this episode of Mars Guy, spring in the northern hemisphere of Mars is about a week away, which means that Ingenuity is past the coldest weather, although it's hardly balmy. But the improving solar power situation means a return to more ambitious flights. As I reported in episode 86, Ingenuity's software update includes hazard avoidance capability for landing and the ability to use digital elevation maps. It looks like the latest flight, number 36, was testing these capabilities. Previous flights along the front of the Delta have literally steered clear of hazardous terrain, staying in a corridor that is flat and boring. But the latest flight went directly over a field of large sand ripples that climb a few meters to the delta, probably a good place to test the software. Here's how it looked with Ingenuity's fisheye navcam. Ingenuity lifted off and flew up to 10 meters altitude, where dust started swirling around the camera lens, followed by the jerky move as it translated to horizontal flight. Next, some small sand ripples came into view. Here's the scene in the forward-looking color camera, which includes one of Ingenuity's feet, appearing notably free of its former dust cover. Also note the size of the sand ripples with Mars Guy for scale. Ingenuity approached much larger ones, which provided a stunning scene for the color camera and a good sense for why this terrain could be hazardous to land on. After 55 meters of flying, Ingenuity stopped for a brief hover, then changed direction, flying directly back along the same route it came in on. With its color camera now facing backward, Ingenuity snapped a shot that looks a lot like the inbound one, but with an orientation that captured a spectacular view of the rugged delta front. Here's what that looks like in the orbital view. It includes the cliffs above the bacon strip feature and boulders shed from layered delta deposits that tower over Mars Guy. The site where Perseverance sampled the bacon strip is off in the distance. Ingenuity continued on to its landing site, the same location it took off from, nearly arriving on the divots made with its feet on the previous landing. This out and back flight appears to be a practice run for the next flight which is planned to go 55 meters, exactly half the 110 meter distance of the current flight. That likely means that it will fly out and land at the location it hovered over before turning around. Landing among the large ripples will be a good test of its new hazard avoidance software. A validation of its improved capabilities will mean that Ingenuity can literally rise above its humble tech demo beginnings and fly up the delta, scouting ahead for perseverance.